Oh yeah. Enough teasing. Let's go for the final part of our galaxy shifters. That is to say, the fourth one. And quite possibly, one of the best. Um, yeah, this guy probably is the best one of the four. That's kind of why I've been saying to last. I mean, Sharpie just to colour in this to fill out the windscreen. Would I, you know, ideally do it because there's the line there for it. But, you know, uh, it does transform almost the same as the Bugatti. But better. This It's just just better. And the colour's nice. Uh, so you can see the kind of spirally sensation there. There's a crisscross pattern to make it look like an actual headlight. They just about kind of make out there. Yeah, it's got the flare. It, it's a very nice looking thing. So there's Mars Attacker, which you can't make out, but I've read it to you, so there you go. And uh, No, all seems quite level. It's a nice looking thing. I mean, this doesn't seem to want to go that far in. If I. No, there you go, there you go. I've shifted it. It's fine. Ooh, uh, but it's a nice little thing. I mean, lick of paint if you were that worried about it, I and mean, this would be a really good looking thing. I can't complain. This looks really good. This is. I want to say some kind of Lamborghini. I don't. I don't know to be honest with you. I couldn't tell you. But this is really good looking. Ah, should we have transformation because it is pretty much the same. But let's go for it. <coughs> and we'll get into that in row. Uh, sorry, later in row mode. But now bring the arms out. Kind of just about grip the thumbs. Bring them out. Slide the arms out. Again, there's a peg there, goes into side there, and you can wriggle this loose, there we go, because it pegs in again. It's all quite straightforward, and fall down to the chest. This is where it gets a little bit funky, I'll just move these up out of the way for now. And everything else, you've had to unpeg it from the back here, and then pull it down. Not so with this one. What you actually do is you wriggle it loose and bring it apart here. It actually has these tabs go under the side there. So it tabs in from the side. So you open it there. There's no trying to bend it underneath like these have had, which almost breaks it. This one opens a lot better. So you bring the legs down, click, and then this whole piece goes around to be a giant toe. Works pretty well. So bring it, bring it down, click, toe. And stand him up a bit. He looks really good. I can't complain. He is he looks really good. I mean again, like there's some detail there which it's kind of standing out on the camera, but it's not standing out so well in real life. Uh, there's the little detail. There's loads of little detail, but it's really faint. You know, it, someone with a lick of paint or something can bring this out. The plastic. It almost some looks like someone's kind of spray primed white. You know, like white plastic, and they spray primed it with a really thin layer of grey. It's got this really weird, like watered down, powdery grey colour to the plastic on the grey. It's really weird. And that head sculpt. Look at that. As I was saying on the blue and red uh, the part 1 and part 3 videos the face that's taken like 5 seconds to doodle in every comic when someone died. This is a similar one but look at that. It's fantastic. There's enough detail to say he might get a couple of speech bubbles, but he's still a generic robot that's going to get shot in the background. But, ah, oh, no, he's he's awesome. He just, I don't know, I really like this guy. Just, he's got a nice vibe to him, just everything. Even the stuff underneath the bonnet, which doesn't matter. It's got a nice feel to it. Looks engine-y and stuff, you know? 
he's, he's got a really nice vibe to him. And yes, it still comes down way too far. It should fold up or something, but it's a pound. What do you want from it? Uh, the only slight problem is because of the way the toes go, it kind of pushes him back. Like if these had gone a little bit further up, which they don't, or if there's some kind of heel that came down, which there isn't, if you get him standing perfectly straight, and no hope. But you know what? He's still really good. I do like him. And he came with one of these, because, you know, three out of four came with the same weapon. Uh, get gone. I've had you hold this before. There we go. And these are, yeah, these shoulders can kind of go inboard a little bit. That's that's quite cool. Yeah, he's got he's got more range in the shit. I I just like this guy. He just feels nice. Yeah. So we'll get him, and then we'll get the Bugatti Ishrobo, uh, the rubbish one of this one because the colours, and the one that's actually got an axe. Come on, guys, don't fight with me. There we go. Clicky, click, click. You go there, you go there. And you go there. And oh, just look at him. I'm not being funny. That cost me £4. I'm happy with that. Just look at him. Because I imagine these would be the two good guys. And those two would be the two bad guys. He's got to be a bad guy. I mean, look at him. <coughs> and he just looks useless. So, bad guy. He's the hero. Going to the box. And he, he's just awesome. He's like... The side swipe of this team. You know? The one that's not the main character. But is awesome. <sighs> and just for the size comparison. Because... I don't know. Maybe someone somewhere will want to know. But there's the Bugatti robot from the X-Force line, which is a bit taller. It's a lot stockier, though. Um, well, so we got the... Uh, yeah, let's just, let's just go with that one. There's Energy on Strong Arm. So these guys are easily warrior class. I mean, easily warrior class. And just because he's lying around... Titans Return Wheelie. So, yeah, there you go. Oh, and if you really, really want to know, uh, give me that. Let me get you. There's a Titan Master. These things are incredibly small. So yeah, it's a um, bit of a shame, really. I mean, you know, you people seem to like these guys. You really do. And what am I doing now? I was looking for something. Oh. Uh, you're really enjoying these guys, and it's a bit of a shame, because... Uh, where's it gone? There's one. Uh. Sorry, one of these boxes has gotten crumpled, so there's one. Move me a 3D model up from Prime and make everything fall over to. I should have thought this through. No, 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 no. Three, four, and yeah, it's a shame. Because there were six and I only got the four because I was stupid and. I don't know, I, I kind of wish I'd got them all. I really do. Because, especially the... This guy. This guy's awesome. And, yeah, I don't know, I mean... I just, I really, really want to... Hey, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. I got the other two. So uh, there's the surprise ending for you boys and girls. Uh, you can look forward to those coming out at some point. Um, I might make you wait for them because to be fair, these guys, don't ask me why, these guys are getting really loads of views. 
So, if anyone wants to put in the comments why these guys keep getting reviews... Uh, sorry, reviews? Why they keep getting views. I do the reviews, you guys watch them. I'm an idiot. But yeah, I mean, feel free, help yourself in the comments. Uh, no one's using them, so you might as well. Uh, yeah, weird. Very weird. And uh, that's these guys, and yeah. He's probably my favourite, although... There is a red version. Oh, the Sunstreaker Sideswipe comparison. Oh, I'm now looking forward to this review. Really looking forward to this review. So, on that note, I should be ugly, I should be wretched, and I shall see you for more Transformery knockoffy whatever goodness next time.